Thursday morning is a little gloomy out there, but it's going to be yeah. a lot nicer later. Right. It's really been a copy and paste this entire week. We've been starting off with fog and then by the afternoon, those clouds mix out, making way for a lot of sunshine. Let's go ahead and start things off from uh, my hometown, Chula Vista. This is Otay Mountain facing westward. You can't really see much because of those low level clouds and they are reducing visibility, especially closer to the foothill and mountains that you are. Right now, Ramona is seeing the worst of it. We're down about eight tenths of a mile. We're seeing it drop off as well for spots like Escondido as well as Poway and even along Kearney Mesa near the 15 current temperatures right now on the surface right now we're seeing mostly scattered 50s west of the mountain communities we're seeing a mix of 40s and 50s for the mountain neighborhoods and we're in the low 60s already for Borrego Springs as well as Ocotillo Wells all right so let's go ahead and roll out a rain cloud future cast and see what's happening aloft high pressure just to the west of us is going to keep things nice tranquil dry pretty warm all the way through Friday but unfortunately we'll have a disturbance this guy right here this is going to be our next weather maker it's brewing currently off uh, the coast of British Columbia that's going to dive southward towards Northern California and the Pacific Northwest and that's going to bring us changes noticeable changes as early as Saturday night so rolling out your cloud rain future cast this is Friday tomorrow morning so we'll have that marine layer redevelop clearing by tomorrow afternoon fast forwarding to Saturday same deal right Saturday morning looks mostly cloudy and then by the afternoon I know a lot of events are happening we'll see mostly sunny skies then around 5 6 we'll have that marine layer push back in as onshore flow strengthens this will be the peak of that onshore flow and then that's when we'll start to likely have some light showers develop so late Saturday all the way into early Sunday coastal areas will be in the mid to upper 60s all the way through Saturday and we'll see about a five degree drop in temperatures on Sunday for the inland valleys will stick in the 70s all all the way through Saturday. The heat peaks tomorrow, so if you have a three-day weekend, go out and enjoy the sunshine because we do have noticeable changes once that three-day weekend comes to an end, if you have Friday off. We'll see about anywhere from a 10 to 20 degree drop in daytime highs. Desert areas will go from the 90s for a couple of days. We'll see a uh, drop in temperatures by a few degrees on Saturday, and then temperatures will plummet about 15 degrees or so by Sunday, and then we have warming making a return towards the start of next week.